Hello there, um, today I'm going to make a video, many people have no idea how to do this and many people have been asking me to do it, so, so, wait, so to do mods, most mods use Minecraft Forge, so what you want to do is go to your, oh, whoops, um, browser to search Minecraft Forge. Choose the top unless it's on ads. So you wanna choose you're going to want to choose the one that says recommended. And you're gonna for the latest version, right now it's one point seven point two. So you want go over here, don't the only one you wanna click is installer, the one that's purple right here. So click leaf page. Whoops, let me read those. Back. Oh. So you want to install it. One second. Skip. Your, this will come up. Um, Mozilla Firefox, this will come up. If it's Internet Explorer, it will be down here. So, you want whatever you use. You want to click save file. Here. You want, oops, you're going to want to minimize this, make a folder, write anything you want, like I'm just going to say Minecraft Forge. Okay, so you, what you want to do is put, wait no, actually you don't have to make a folder, let's get rid of this, no, no folder, sorry about that. So you want to click here, and you want to click here, okay, and then this will install. I've already installed it, so it says gr grab zero quite robberies. And then when you t install it, you're going to want to go to your Minecraft. Um, wish I could pause. I'm using screencast on Mac, which you probably obviously know because it says that. If you know how to pause, tell me. So, because you got it, you're going to want to log in again. Log in, and then you know what? Mainly, oops. For you, it's gonna say like your username or something. But then, when you're on it, you're gonna see Forge. You wanna click that. See that? See how ready to play Minecraft on whatever your version is, which it can be that, but it's the latest Minecraft Forge. So you wanna click play. I'm gonna pause it. Oh yeah. Oh, found out how to pause it. Okay, guys. So um, I got. It. It's gonna say three mod loaded, which is not an actual. Mod. This is the thing that comes with to run the um Minecraft Forge. So never delete those, which I don't think you can. Well, yes, you can, but never disable them. So you want to exit out your Minecraft. You're going to want to go to a website mod find any mod which I'm gonna get the the let's see, the raider mod actually the cape mod it's the only one I really well you wanna find cape mod this and then you want make sure it says forge buy it let's see if it says forge as long uh, because we're using Forge, it has to say Forge by it. So let's see. I'll pause it until I find one. Okay, guys, I found a Minecraft mod for Minecraft Forge. Um, I couldn't find the Cape one, so I'm using the Voxel Map Minecraft mod. So it says f Forge version. Click that, and then a thing will pop up. Right here. Um. And then, to say for this, so you want to download this. Uh, 
I'll pause it until I get ready. Okay, so I'll load it and this will pop up. Fox home map. So this going to want to go into okay, oh yeah, I forgot. You So you want to go press okay, so what you wanna do it what what? So let's minimize this, get rid of this. Minimize this and for Windows which is I have it on my computer if it Windows and R at the same time, and this will come up. Alright app percent app data percent. Okay? And then you're going to well, Minecraft and then you need to find mods right here and then if it says it's empty but so you want to go drag your minecraft mod into the folder click this and this should be ready so it's ready X this out and then I'm gonna pause this time on minecraft Okay, my Minecraft is loading right now, so I'm going to show you the, the mod. Um, here it is. Oops. Here we go. So it's almost done. So it's going to say, if you have one mod, it'll say four mods because you need the three mods for it to work. For the study, and then see, I got the Vixel map, and sometimes the mods will say tell you what to do and stuff. So I got the Mixel map; it's a radar. So it says Z to change it, X to toggle the size of it. I think toggle large map, M to bring up the mini map menu. Okay, so done, and let's just go in single player. I don't play in as much. I guess I'll go in this. Also, oh yeah, I did not make this. Um, somebody else did. Um, I I'll show you how to get other people's worlds in a different video. Oops, must be lagging a little. Play select world. What? Oh yeah, I was gonna land thing. I didn't get how to do it. The world setting. Um, I think I'm at night time. See, it'll say this. Um, when I first got this, it scared me a little. <gasps> okay, so it's gonna tell you what to do. So, B quickly at a waypoint. X waypoints are important. So if you like a house or something, X toggle screen map. Z zoom in out. Z. And B. Can s name it like, say, let's pretend I'm, let's say I'm at my house, house, or house or crib or crib or house, whatever. Um, you can name it whatever you want, and then choose whatever color you want. You can say if you want to see it from your nether or the, and I recommend keep it in the same world. So, because if you're in the ender nether, you're gonna be like, where is my house? Because some people build stuff in the places, so so yeah, that's all. Um, I hope this helped you. I this is a laggy. Other ones are not. Um, I hope this helped you. Stuff. I'll show you how to do. Um, I'll show you how to get worlds from other people soon enough. Uh, a later video. So hope this helped you. In um. Yeah, hope this improves your Minecraft experience. Peace.